Apparently this website is run by school marms who won't let me speak my mind until seven seconds are up. So we are almost there and awesome. I feel like I have assholish tendencies. I enjoy the hunt of making fun of people. But there are ethical ways to do that and there are unethical ways to do that. There's a lot of stuff I've wanted to say, but it just wouldn't have been right to flame certain people. Today, I want to flame someone who deserves to be flamed. I stumbled across this video recently, and I was flabbergasted. I was... I was... I was... Frankly, I was hornswoggled. I was, uh, shook. And I'm gonna get into why. Let's jump into this video, smoking a large cigarette at the store. What is good, Yodi family? Damien Luck back with another banger. I am the original Fulcrum. Fulcrum, come in. Yo, Yodi gang, you feel me? And you best believe it, today I am back with another banger, you feel me? Right now I'm in this classic Yodi land location, back in Lowe's, you feel me? If you couldn't tell already, I'm here the day after Black Friday. Do people still make videos like this? This feels so antiquated now. It feels so odd to see a YouTuber in the year of our Lord, 2023, to be coming out the gate with the Yo, what's good fam? What's up, scrotum gang? We out here with another video. Today we're in Lowe's, fucking around, being a general menace to society. I thought we were done with this. It's a video sharing platform. Just make your damn video and throw it up there. Why do we need this fucking same strange parasocial song and dance. But real, spill, I got the Yodi Land Pack tobacco, you feel me? Shouts out to Yodi Land Pack, you feel me? My own brand in this hole. The Yodi Land Pack, Fulcrum, come in. Yup. That's what we got in here today, Yodi, feel me? I put like, I put hella tobacco in here. I stuffed this hole with tobacco, you feel me? Real, spill. We're gonna have a good time, you feel me? I hope you guys are having a good holiday season for real, for real. Keep it pushing every single day, Yodi family, real spill. What is this man saying? It's a minute and 23 seconds into the video. Like he's saying words, but they just kind of wash over my brain. How can you say so many words and have so few of them mean anything? Well, the holidays aren't over. A lot of people had Thanksgiving this week, you feel me? And then we got Christmas coming up and stuff. You feel me? We had Halloween. Bro is padding out this watch time right now. <laughs> what the... Hold on, I think I got it. I think he's nervous about the public nuisance he's about to become. <laughs> so he's just walking around the store, hyping himself up. <laughs> his heart's beating out of his chest. I'm gonna spark my cigarette right now, you feel me? Fat ass cigarette? I don't think anyone smoked a cigarette this big inside the Lowe's before. All right, Yodi family, I got the world's largest cigarette lit right now. I got the world's largest cigarette. I got the I got the world's largest cigarette. He just hit him with a. <laughs> I got the Yodi Land Pack, world's largest cigarette. You want to try it? No thanks. Okay, you guys have a good day. Right. Okay, you guys have a good day. Like there are two types of you guys have a good day. There's like, oh, I just had a conversation with you, and I'm leaving now. So, oh, okay, okay, great, you have a good day, right? And then there's the getting rejected by a girl. You have a good day. The, hey, can I have your number? <laughs> I have a boyfriend. Okay, you have a good day. Hold on, hold on. Can you say hi to my boyfriend? Yeah, sure. I'm out here with the cigarette. Best believe it. What's his name? Brayden. Hell yeah, shout out to Brayden. Best believe it. Faded. Mm, I don't believe you. He does have a million subscribers. I don't have the ability to fathom yet what someone with a million subscribers, what you're like rate of being noticed in public is oh i didn't i don't have anything no i know but we don't do vaping in here either so. okay i'll stop vaping okay sorry about that you can't expect anyone to hold your hand 
and pick you up when you're down, Yodi family. We can only save ourselves at the end of the day. No one's coming to save us, Yodi family, for real, for real. It's good to show love and help people out, bro. I love helping people out, bro. Like, that's really what makes me satisfied. Homeboy's got, like, generic positive message chat GPT bot built into his brain. I, I always am so weirded out by people who have this talent to be able to, like, string a bunch of words together that technically mean something but also don't mean anything at all. That's what the Uncanny Valley is, is is it's our most innate in instincts warning us when something is imitating humanity. That's <laughs> that's what this is. It's like you're not being a real human being right now. You're basically like a very primordial piece of code born out of YouTube algorithm incentives strung together and and put into a fleshy form. I don't know if that makes any sense. Sir, watch this. Big ass, big ass cigarette. You want to try it? Okay, have a good day. Homeboy needs to get better at farming these reactions. This is just sad to watch. Sure, watch this. Hey, bro. Yes, sir. Take that outside. You want me to leave? Okay, I'll leave right now. Right now. All right, Yodi family, I'm getting kicked out of the lows right now, you feel me? Look at my man proudly taking on the walk of shame. You know, the the biggest crime here is just being cringe to me. To just to just be the guy who smokes in public just to make people uncomfortable and film their reaction to it, especially the poor employees whose job it is to escort you the fuck out of there man like i thought we were at the point where that was common etiquette on youtube these days just like don't fuck with service workers don't fuck with restaurant workers don't fuck with general blue collar workers who are just trying to get through the day especially not as someone who's making money uploading garbage to youtube like just wait a second I thought, I assumed this was just a one-off. Almost all of his videos are him smoking in places you're not allowed to smoke. That's like his thing. Okay, so it, it looks like what I'm guessing happened here was he figured out a content strategy where you're always going to get kicked out of public places for smoking in them, but it's not ever treated so seriously that it's something you'd actually get arrested for. Just generally being a nuisance to his local community. Uh, anyway, by the way, I made a video about Haley Lusion uh, maybe a month or two ago. That performed pretty well, but it had an unintended consequence. That unintended consequence was my audience is now 90% male. <laughs> so do me a favor. In the comments section, write a welcome message to all the women who have stumbled across this video. Let's see if we can get that number a little bit more balanced in the name of equality. Okay, everybody. Thanks so much. Bye.